the Minico Spartans kicked off their season with an exhibition game at Holt Arena versus Skyline. Friday, those same two teams will meet again, this time with a state championship title on the line. Our offense stepped up. We were able to run the football. They took that away. We were able to throw the football, and the special teams was huge. It just seems like somebody takes something away, and we have other kids that are stepping up and, and making plays for us. Making it to a state championship game is a program first. I can't express to you in words how cool this is. This is, this is awesome. It's come full circle, and uh, we've improved, and they've improved, and. Uh, it should be a lot of fun. There's a lot of folks around the state that underestimate um, what's going on down here in Minico, but this is a special group of boys. The bond Tim Perigo has with this year's quarterback runs a little deeper. That's because it's his son, John. The one thing that we share together in life um, is uh, football, and I I've, I've feel blessed uh, to have the opportunity to coach my son. He's a coach here, and then he's a parent at home. It's been pretty awesome. You know, I have to say he's probably my favorite coach I've ever had, and uh, you know, it's just an experience that I can't really, ex it's hard to explain sometimes. But with John's high school football career coming to an end on Friday, win or lose, this season has been one Tim Perigo will never forget. What a great opportunity to, to be able to be on the sideline with your son, to be in the state championship game. Uh, it's, it's, it's a great ending to a book. It's a, it's a, it's a great story. The father-son coach-player duo will kick off their final game Friday at 8.15. Morgan Rumpf, KMVT, Local 11 News.